All right, welcome back to Western Wilds. Today we're going to sell um, what we got left of products up here. Well, at least the, some of the stuff. And then we're going to plant, I was going to plant sorghum in this one field right there, but I kind of got started so the worker could do some stuff. And it ended up being oats, so it's okay. We need to put some oats into the bakery over here anyway, so guess we can get the bread first, get it out the way. Not much of it, and I don't think it sells good until November, but we're going to go ahead and get rid of it. I think we should have some butter and stuff to sell too out of the dairy. That's the cheese, but we will get it here in just a second get this stuff put into the bakery over here we've got quite a bit of it and we got um, barrels and stuff I think to sell Just a little bit of selling stuff here to start with. Nothing major. Get all this put in here. So we can get more bread. Betsy turn for me. There we go. And then we'll get this back in there. Come on. And that puts us at how much flour in the bakery? Pretty good. I think we'll leave it at that. I don't think Yeah, okay, we're okay there. Now let's get our dairy stuff and sell it. And we'll go get the barrels and all that. Eventually, I want to make cake, but we're gonna have to do the sugar, which I said would be next year, so. We'll take care of that. Get our fields and stuff ready. This winter all right so that's all it let's, let's just grab a couple of these too while we're at it and just sell them to as much oats as we've got we'll be fine so we'll go over here and sell this stuff go get our barrels and buckets and whatnot up there we're gonna sell the clothes next month I think that's the timing for them we 
probably got quite a few. I think there's 60 some thousand liters there. Also, at some point in time, I don't know if I'll do it now or between, but we need to get wood up here and make some planks. Got some wood going on down there. We're going to plant the oak field first. We can come back and do that at the end. I do believe. Mail that say we had, we might need to get some. And we're okay for a little bit with the metal. Is that everything now? Sure is. Okay. Now with our cotton, we're gonna sell all of it. Cause I still have cotton in there. We can load up a couple of these shingles, I think this is, is this shingles. Yes. And load them up for us. Take them, sell them. And we'll leave them to there. I still got some bowls we need to pick up. Flooring we need to pick up. It had been a while since I'd done selling on here. So I usually do this in between just because it's like, this is it. <laughs> but I figure somebody might like watching it. See how we keep getting our money. And I cut some of them off sometimes. I mean, sometimes I cut them on. We're not hurting for money, obviously. Still 36,000 here. Come on, spawn. There we go. The fork truck driver is sleeping on the job, I do believe. I bet he's certified too. Forklift operator. Certified gold, baby. <laughs> oh god. See, I mean, this is just... Well, I mean, this whole game is repetitive, but I mean, this is pretty much all this is. This is why I always just do this in between, but... I figure we might as well do it today. We ain't got a lot going on besides planting that one field. And I think, if we look, this one. I can plant sorghum next month and it will be ready in September when there's nothing else to harvest. So, that will work. Because if I planted this month, it had been August and we have been harvesting. We'll be harvesting oats in August. That one that we're planting now. And in July, we'll get the ones we planted last episode. In June, we got canola coming up. And in July, we'll have the wheat. So, that's what we got going on. And like I said, this this one will go to Tuesdays and Thursdays now, this series. And the drifter will take over this spot. Starting the July 24th. There's just so much more to do on drifter. Well, I mean, there's plenty to do on here, but there's just more interesting stuff to do. This is pretty much rinse and repeat because we've got it established. And I personally think it's more fun to work towards stuff. But yeah, I think sorghum in that the cornfield we had last year will do good. And that kind of gives us something to plant. I mean to harvest and it keeps us busy. 
put it that way. We can sell it, we can do whatever. I think, I want to change it. I think our beans go next month, maybe June. This says July, I'm pretty sure, but it's never right. So, we might sell them next month. Mm, wood we'll put in. Hay we're going to keep for sheep and to make uh, TMR. Butter and stuff's so October. Pig food. We actually got quite a bit of gold. And it's July. And I am May. Nothing in May. But I think those may sell next month. See, we still got 154,000 liters of cotton to run our clothes factory over there. And there's like 100 some liters in there already, so. Is that it? No, I know I keep looking. Oh, four more. And these will keep spawning, but we're not going to worry about them. Unless we got a lot. Let's go over and check uh, the floors. Yeah. We'll pick these four up. It's cut off because we're out of planks. So. I think that's it for this. Yes, it is. So we'll go over here and get these four and pallets. We'll probably swing by and grab that one too, just cause. I think it's cut off too. I need to get the planks going, I guess. I think we got a cat. Whatever. Tree house or whatever it is. We'll pick it up, sell it too, and that should be it. I may just go ahead and get the timber now. And then we will go and... Actually, no, let's let it run a little bit longer. And then we'll go, we'll go plant that field real quick, and then we'll bring the timber up here. That gives us 17 million up to now. So. Of course I went the wrong way. There we go. I think this is running. Now it is. Yeah, we'll get this guy going. We'll sit in here with him and watch him, and I'll see you when we get done with the time lapse.
finished here and we will go and set up the um, stuff over there wherever it's at there we go Okay, so that, and then we hit the period on the numpad to change the load, and we crash into that. That's always fun. Alright, so we'll switch it to right. Get the wood out of here. And they should load us up. And we switch it. We do it again. turn the truck over because I usually always do Quite a bit in there. Wooden planks, the long ones. All right. Well, we'll continue to do this because it needs to be done. Those trees there, I don't know. They're growing pretty good. I think we still got a little bit of time though. Warm. Take us long to clear this out. I mean, we're doing pretty good on it, I do believe. We'll have planks galore that we can move into the productions next time, maybe. There's too much. I 
don't leave us very much left. It don't take long to go through it. It takes even less time to make planks out of it. I'll let the planks run overnight and then, or we can let it run through the day and then I can put them in there later on in the day, you know? Uh, we got most everything turned off anyways. Okay. This is a nice little setup here. Well, it was. <laughs> it was a nice setup till some idiot decided to drive into it. This should be it. Should be the last load. I don't know. I'm stuck in the box. I don't know if we have. Worked okay for us. We'll park this up. And I think we'll call her. I think, I know I sold that big cedar, but I think we'll go ahead and buy it again. Um, just because. Oh, look. That could be cool to use for the how much is it off you know what why not <laughs> why not I think we'll buy it again just to point that we'll lease it I think that'll work No point to buy it. And that will be to plant the sorghum in that field over there. And I know I just leased it. I'm going to have to pay an extra day. But that's alright. We'll be alright with it. So we got that planted. We got all these planted. Everything's planted except for the big field down there we had corn in last time. So I'll take this up here. For the next episode. It'll already be up there when we just hook up and bring it down here. And then I do believe after the next episode, which will be planting that gigantic field back there, we will have a harvest. I don't know if it's the wheat or the canola. I think it's the canola. So yeah. We will be harvesting. Well, I mean, we're only doing two episodes. They might be a little longer episodes. We'll see. I don't know. I'm winging all this stuff. I have no idea hardly anything other than what days something needs to go out <laughs> yeah we'll get this up here and we'll drive that new vehicle back down the new mower well new to us mower just cause I mean we got money we need to play with stuff you know so this thing is just humongous if I ain't mistaken Mistaken. I hook into that one first and then the other one. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. But that'll be next time.
I'll have it down there ready when we go. Let's drive this little jewel. That's pretty fast, honestly. We can use this to mow our grass, surely. We'll take it down here and park it at the garage and give it a whole once over there a little bit and call it a day. I mean, you never, I know we'll never get big stuff on drifter series that's just common sense because that map is small but you know you never know when you're going to have another map that you can get a lot of money on and do stuff so something like this comes up we'll try it out and just like that big cedar back there we just rented again i didn't like it the first time it's just awkward i mean it's good it works fast it works great it's just i don't know A little awkward for this guy. But it is what it is. We'll we'll try this jewel out probably around I don't know where we've already used all the grass. Alright, let's get this door open, the middle one. Turn a light on at least. We'll pull this in here and we'll get her worked on. There we go. Let's see how much that's going to cost us. Four thousand. That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Probably use a repaint, but again, that's not bad. Not too shabby, but next episode we'll be planting that field right there. And then, depending on how long it takes, we may mow our grass field. I don't know if it's even close to being ready, to be honest. Hey, that one's pH wasn't too bad. This one should be perfect. And this is the field we will plant next time with sorghum, I do believe. We will put some sorghum in this. If our grass is ready, we may can do it too. And it looks to be like it is. It's that golden... Yeah. So we may do some grass next time. Who knows? We will see. That's all I can say. And we will probably expand this field out that way. I'm still going to wait till that video comes out and y'all tell me which way. But anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.